Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Slide Masters in PowerPoint set the default layout and appearance of presentation slides. When you add presentation slides and apply a slide layout, the slide is formatted according to the Slide Master's specifications. Each Slide Master has several associated slide layouts. You can also use more than one Slide Master in a presentation if desired. You can create and customize your own slide layouts and Slide Masters in PowerPoint. You can then save these into a custom template for future use. To create and or edit slide masters and slide layouts in a PowerPoint presentation, click the View tab in the ribbon. Then click the Slide Master button in the Master Views button group. Doing this then shows the presentation slide masters and their associated slide layouts in the slide thumbnails pane at the left side of the window. Each slide master appears at the top of a hierarchy of connected slide layouts in this pane. Each associated slide layout appears as a branch of the slide master. The currently selected slide master and slide layout in the slide thumbnails pane appears for editing in the main window. A new slide master contextual tab also appears in the ribbon. You use the commands and buttons in the button groups on this contextual tab to change the slide masters and associated slide layouts. To insert a new slide master into a presentation, Click the Insert Slide Master button in the Edit Master button group on the Slide Master contextual tab of the ribbon. To insert a new layout for a selected Slide Master, click the Insert Layout button in the Edit Master button group on the Slide Master contextual tab of the ribbon. To customize a Slide Master, select it in the Slide Thumbnails pane. To select which default placeholders are available for the selected slide master in PowerPoint, click the Master Layout button in the Master Layout button group on the Slide Master tab of the ribbon to open the Master Layout dialog box. In this dialog box, check the checkboxes for the default placeholders to add to the slide master, and then click the OK button. To rename a selected slide master in PowerPoint, Click the Rename button in the Edit Master button group on the Slide Master contextual tab of the ribbon to open the Rename Master dialog box. In this dialog box, type a new name for the Slide Master into the Master Name field, and then click the Rename button. To save a selected Slide Master in a presentation, even if it is not actively used by any presentation slides, Click the Preserve button in the Edit Master button group on the Slide Master contextual tab of the ribbon. To delete a custom Slide Master you created, click the Delete button in the Edit Master button group on the Slide Master contextual tab of the ribbon. To add a new custom slide layout to a Slide Master in PowerPoint, select the Slide Master to which to add the custom layout. Alternatively, select the slide layout below which to insert the custom slide layout. Then click the Insert Layout button in the Edit Master button group on the Slide Master contextual tab of the ribbon. If you previously selected the slide master, then the new slide layout is added to the bottom of its related slide layouts. If you selected a slide layout instead, then the new slide layout appears below the selected slide layout. It is selected after it is inserted by default. To add placeholders to a slide layout associated with a slide master in PowerPoint, select the desired slide layout in the slide thumbnails pane. You can hover your mouse pointer over a slide layout associated with a slide master to see its name appear in a screen tip so you know which slide layout you are changing. Then click the Insert Placeholder drop-down button in the Master Layout button group on the Slide Master contextual tab of the ribbon. Then select the type of placeholder to add to the slide layout from the drop-down menu. Then click and drag over the area in the slide layout where you want the new placeholder to appear. Repeat this as needed until you have added the desired placeholders to the slide layout. To show or hide the slide title and or footer placeholders in the slide layout if desired, check or uncheck the title, 
and footers checkboxes in the same button group. To delete a selected slide layout from a slide master in PowerPoint, click the Delete button in the Edit Master button group on the Slide Master contextual tab of the ribbon. To rename a selected slide layout within a Slide Master set in PowerPoint, click the Rename button in the Edit Master button group on the Slide Master contextual tab of the ribbon to open the Rename Layout dialog box. In this dialog box, type a new name for the Slide Master into the Layout Name field, and then click the Rename button. To close the Slide Master view in PowerPoint after customizing a presentation's Slide Masters and Slide Layouts, Click the Close Master View button in the Close button group on the Slide Master Contextual tab of the ribbon. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.